What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to my channel. In this video I want to show you how to do integration of x times arc sine x squared dx. So the first thing I need to do, I have, I'm going to consider x squared as something like t. So I'm going to use substitution method. So then 2x dx is going to be equal to dt. So then x dx will be equal to dt over 2. So instead of these two parts, I will write dt over 2. So it's going to be arc sine t dt over 2 or 1 over 2 arc sine t dt. Now, I want to use integration by part. Integration by part I use here 1 times arc sine t dt. So I'm going to consider u as arc sine t and dv is going to be 1 times dt. So v will be t and du will be 1 over square root of 1 minus u squared or t, uh, t squared dt. So then I have uv minus vdu, the integration of vdu. So it's going to be, uh, the integration of this part is going to be u times v, which is t times arc sine t minus v, which is t times du which is 1 over square root of 1 minus t squared dt then I need to find out the integration of this part it will be integration of t 1 over root of 1 minus t squared I will have have it as negative 2 and 1 over 2 and negative t here so I multiply by negative 2 times and multiply by 2 and 1 over 2 so it's going to be and you have dt here so it's going to be minus t squared to the power of it was negative 1 over 2 so it's going to be 1 over 2 divided by 1 over 2 so then this 1 over 2 and this 1 over 2 cancel out and it will be So then it's going to be here, 1 over 2, coming from here, it's going to be t times arc sine t minus, and the answer to this part was square root of 1 minus t square plus c. And we know t is x squared, so I can write 1 over 2 x squared arc sine x squared minus 1 minus x to the power of 4 plus c. So that's going to be the final answer to this question. Please leave me a comment if you have any question and I get back to you as soon as I can. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. You can watch lots of videos regarding integration. 